Hey, what's up, YouTube? Thank you for stopping by. Just making a quick video explaining how to collect Hot Wheels. I've only been collecting for two years now, and I'll try my best to explain it. Starting off with the case, this is what the Hot Wheel case um, will look like. This is the main line. Um, there's different types of um, Hot Wheels to collect. Main lines, which are these ones. This here is the D case, 72 pieces. How we release is 15 cases each year. We go from A to H, which is A case, B case, C case, etc. A to H, skip I, J to N, skip O, and then the last two cases, P and Q. 15 cases throughout the whole year, 72 cars in each case. So that's this right here. And every year, Hot Wheel releases 250 cars. So for instance, this one is number 10. Let's see, that's number 10 of 250, okay? Out of the 250 cars or castings will be different categories, also known as series. Now that could be distinguished with these. That's that's what these are for. So this one is the Hot Wheel Speed Graphics um, series, okay? This one will be Hot um, J Imports, Hot Wheel J Imports, so Japan Imports. This one is a factory fresh, okay? So you see how there's eight out of 10? Out of the whole year, there's gonna be 10 of these factory fresh series. So there's 10 in this series, okay? For this series, the tuned series, there's five in this 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 um, series. There's about 30, 30 to 35 series. I'm not too sure exactly how Hot Wheel um, decides how many um, series to run, but that's what I've counted so far. And each year, they will release new castings or new cars. Some cases will have the new ones. For instance, this was in 2021. So this is the first time they made this, this um, car or casting for this year. So after this year, they'll continue um, releasing them in different colors. Depends on what, what they wanna run. Um, for instance, this one, okay? So 2021, Nissan G35, Nissan 35 GT. Okay, that's the, I, I believe this was first and then this was the recolor. Okay, this is the recolor. So that was, that's also another thing um, when you're collecting Hot Wheels, there's, there's recolors on some cars, not all of them, but some of them do. These are some of the new, new releases for this year, 2022. Okay, it's a tuned Volkswagen, tuned Silverado, coupe clip. I know you guys seen this, it was a silver one. When it first released, it was a silver one. This is the recolor, okay? It's a really nice red one. New for 2022, okay? You can see that? This is really nice. This is actually based off of a real car. Okay, the Hot Wheel Legends Tour, people go and submit their builds to make it into a Hot Wheel. So this is actually a real car. Another favorite for this year, the EG Honda Civic, custom EG, Nissan Silvia. Okay, this is a Turbo Series. I like that one. JM Ports and Turbo Series, my favorites. Well, one of my favorites, or just one of the ones I enjoy collecting. Okay, another thing. Each case will have a super and a treasure hunt. How do you tell which is which? Just a little bit of research. My way of finding out what's um, what the treasure hunts and supers are is I just do Google, Google it. So like I said, there's 15 cases. I'll just look up a case super treasure hunt, a case treasure hunt. Then it'll show, pull up pictures, you know. The good thing about it is Hot Wheel releases cases out in international before the U.S. So what I do is I search on YouTube what um, cars are going to be coming in the A case, um, B case, C case, etc. Because the international people will, will, will have it first. And there's a lot of collect. There's some collectors that upload it to YouTube. So... That's why I do a lot of my research. I just go and watch some unboxing, like the one that I have. 
and um, I just go from there and then I'll, I'll pick what cars I want, the ones I think are cool, the ones I'll look for, okay? But one thing you can look for is the flame logo. See that flame logo? That's it. The flame logo right there. And also on the card behind it is going to be a gray flame. Okay, on the card we'll have the flame logo somewhere, and this one is right there. And the card in the back, and it will say, it'll, somewhat, sometimes it'll, it'll um, have an error and it won't print it in the back, but it'll tell you that you've won a treasure hunt. By far the best treasure hunt for 2022, in my opinion, okay? The Subaru Impreza, just the color alone is nice. I need to put some pink wheels on it or magenta or whatever that color is. That really set that car off, okay? So these are treasure hunts. Now, supers. This is my first super and only super for this year. See that gold flame? Sorry. The gold flame. The really nice, nice shiny paint, and it has real tires, rubber wheels. This was my first super. Oh, also, it'll have a TH for treasure hunt on it. Okay, this was from last year, I believe. Gold flame, spectral paint, paint, spectral paint. Shiny paint, real tires, okay. Another super, really nice. One thing about Hot Wheels, there's no, no wrong way of collecting Hot Wheels. I think to me, a bad way to do it is just buying everything. Buy what you like. It doesn't matter what anybody else likes, you buy what you like. That's your money, you enjoy your castings. Or another, this is a cool series from a while back, maybe a couple years ago. So this is a now and then series, okay? But this one is cool because this is a treasure hunt and it had the newer one, 2015, and that's a 91 Miata. It's two nice castings. Thought it was cool. Okay, we just finished, they just released a Q case. So A case is, the new year is about to start with a new case. A case is coming up. Go on YouTube, look up Hot Wheels A case, and it'll pop up. But these are the my findings for the Q case, last case of the year. Some nice cars in this one, okay? 95 Mazda Miata. This is a recolor. It's a nice one. There's that 35 GT recolor that I showed you earlier, the red and the blue one. Here's the white one, okay? A recolor of the EG, the Honda. I like this red color better than the blue, of course. The recolor of this Toyota van. This is one of my favorite castings of this year. A new one for 2022. It came in a maroon or a red. And this is the second color it, it, it released. Supra, okay. There's the recolor, you seen that Supra earlier. It was yellow. Now this is in red. This is a now and then. I have the... Dang, where's that other Supra? I think it's upstairs somewhere. I have to dig it up. But these are all my latest finds, but you know, um, for the year, the last of the year. I missed the P case. I've hit almost every case except the P case for this year. Okay, Thunderbird, that's a really nice pink. I didn't find a super for this one. This would be the super for the Q case. Um, this is not the one, but this is the car. It would have like a way better paint, shinier, real wheels, and uh, you know, the logo and all that. Really nice La Troca. Let's crack this open. Get a better look at it. Yeah, it's nice. And I'm sorry if I'm doing it over here or, you know, my hands because it's on the holder and I can see the camera shows it better or I can see it better. 
It's going to go with all the other low riders. One of my favorite castings or favorite series for this year was the wagons. This was another one new for this year. One of my favorites. The Hot Wheel wagons was one of my is is one of my favorite series so far. Bunch of nice wagons um, came out this year, and the hatchbacks as well. I have this. I found this year's Christmas cars. They have Christmas, Halloween, Easter, Easter series. Now these are themed cars. Um, I don't know if it's specific to a certain store, but that's the Chrysler Pacifica. Each year they come out with different cars, different designs. Okay. I really like this one, these, these, um, this series because the snow. The, the white snow on the on the fenders really look nice. So this is probably my this is my favorite out of the whole series, out of this set. And then the last one, oh, come on, carbonator, okay, so bottle opener, cap opener. Every year it seems to be this same one, but just a different design. That's these, you know, mainline themes. Then we have premiums, which are about five, six, seven bucks now. Real tires, all metal, metal um, body, metal base. Okay, a little bit more detail, bigger cars, or bigger, bigger cards. You know, comes with the whole set. By far my favorite uh, monster truck right now. It's an S10, and I really like that retro look. Yeah, I mean. I've been busy collecting here and there, but not, I haven't been doing a uh, recording a lot. So a lot of basic cars. I don't do much um, customs. That's actually my first custom, the CRX right there. I'll pull it out in a bit. This diorama I built myself um, cause I was a cheapskate and didn't want to pay the money for it. Gas station my wife bought me as a present. Um, for my collection. Some of my fav favorite castings right now is the Mad Manga. Well, probably my favorite casting so far. Out of all the Hot Wheels I collect, this is my favorite casting or car, whatever you want to call it. My favorite one so far. <clears throat> All right, let's get this. I actually, you know, dropped it. I messed up the rear lights. So I was doing some experimenting, tried to put silver on it and see if the red popped out more, but it didn't. So yeah, back to square one, I'll strip it anyways. I need to strip it because this chip right here, a couple chips over here. So I'm gonna strip it and respray it and all that. I hope I did justice. I'm trying to explain it. A case is about to be released, so keep an eye out. Oh, one thing to tell what case you're at, right here, C.Q, the last letter, that's the case it's at. Q case, okay? Okay, J case. So if you're seeing the J case on the pegs, then the K case is going to be next. Jump on YouTube or Google, see what's in the K case, what cars are coming out next, and pick out which ones you like, and then look out for them. Hopefully that was good enough. Um, if not, I can do another video explaining it all over again. I, I can do that. This was like a uh, spur of the moment. It's been a minute since I um, did a YouTube video, but... A shout out to all the subscribers. Um, I appreciate you guys tapping in. If you're um, new, hit the subscribe button. I'll be trying to make more content. I need to catch up. Um, time to stop procrastinating. All right, you guys have a good one. Either.